For many months now, many of you have heard me talk about deodorants and particularly antiperspirants as being probably the very worst actor in all of the personal care products that you can purchase today in the consumer marketplace. I believe that deodorants and antiperspirants probably are potentially more harmful than any other personal care product hiding in your cabinet today. Now, you've heard me talk a little bit about these uh, antiperspirants and these deodorants, but I want you to think for just a moment about these products that people are putting on their skin. These are products that always come with very aggressive uh, warning labels on the product itself, on the package. Uh, these are warnings about being careful using these products with broken skin. It's very interesting to me though that many of these products will actually warn you about the potential that you have to damage your kidneys. Or if you have kidney issues, you shouldn't use these products. Now, if you think about that for just a minute, you know, your kidneys are a long way from your armpits. And what that tells you is that these are chemicals that are going into the body and are being carried through the bloodstream. They're winding up in the kidneys and they're doing a lot of potential harm and damage. And that's why those warnings are there. Well, I can tell you that there are a lot of other additional reasons to be worried and concerned about the potentially harmful ingredients in these deodorants and in these antiperspirants. Let me show you this one in particular that I think is, uh, is a very bad actor in the arena of antiperspirants. And this just happens to be a fairly common product that you might buy at the store. But I want you to see that on top of all of the other harmful, potentially harmful ingredients that are in this product, this is also a product that is absolutely loaded with alcohol. And of course you can see this product uh, burning here. Now I tell people all the time that if, uh, if the power goes out in your house, this is a great product to have around. Certainly, uh, you can see that it's, uh, it's lighting there, it's burning off the alcohol. The alcohol is just part of the harmful ingredients, like I said, that you will find in this product. You know, no personal care product that you put on your body should do that. So, I want to introduce to you uh, this new product that I think is absolutely remarkable. And this is the Trevani Deodorant Mist. Let me just make sure that fire is good and put out. This is a remarkable product. I can tell you there is nothing in this product that is flammable. There is no reason that uh, you wouldn't be able to put this product under your arm if you had a kidney challenge. Uh, I can tell you that there are no potentially harmful ingredients in this product. In fact, this product, like all other products sold at Trevani, uh, very proudly stands behind the do no harm philosophy. This is a brilliant product. Uh, we're going to go through and talk a little bit about the ingredients. Trevani deodorant completely complies with Trevani's do no harm philosophy to avoid any potential harmful ingredients that may be found in mainstream deodorants and antiperspirants including parabens, triclosan, propylene glycol, alcohol, aluminum compounds, and ethoxylated surfactants. Polyglycerol 3 caprolate is a plant-based antibacterial substance providing gentle on-demand protection for 24 hours. Sodium eucinate is extracted from natural lichen and helps fight odor-causing bacteria. Caprolyl glycol then helps to improve the effectiveness of sodium eucinate even further. One of the things that you're going to find with this product is that not only are the ingredients very safe for use uh, by people of all ages, but it is incredibly effective.